Good morning everybody! It's me again, Crazy Bag Lady. So it's Wednesday morning. I was about to say it's Tuesday, but it's not Tuesday, it's Wednesday. Weather, a bit gloomy, a bit rainy and windy. I don't I mean, like wind because um, you worry about things blowing on you and stuff. So weather's a bit blurred this morning. Hello ladies! Hello everybody! So little Peggy and her friend Pat and all her other little friends, hope you're okay. So calendar of the day, so we missed yesterday, I forgot to do it. So yesterday's was, um, a constant friend is a thing rare and hard to find. Oh yes it is. Right, and Wednesday! There is nothing more properly, there is nothing more properly the language of the heart than the wish. Oh. Yes, yeah, nice to have a lovely wish, isn't it? And hopefully one day they come true. Right, so a bit of a little bit of rain's magic. So we've got if you give people a chance, they shine. Oh, everybody shines sometimes, don't they? That's so lovely. And then midlife crisis. Are we ready? Um, allow me to put the record straight. I'm 46 and have been for some years past. <laughs> when women past 30, they first forget their age. When 40, they forget that they ever remembered it. A diplomat is a man who always remembers a woman's birthday but never remembers her age. Oh, that middle one's very true, isn't it? <laughs> Happy Wednesday! Right, first treat of the morning. A full wash basket again after only washing on Monday. Mm, thumbs down for that please <laughs> right so we've got washing to do um i was gonna dash off early this morning and go for like a vin uh, village charity shop and then i thought i can't really be bothered so i fancied staying in with a nice warm cup of tea in my breakfast so what we're gonna do i thought i really need to sort my clothes out properly um so i'm gonna have a big clothes sort out and obviously wash your empty dishwasher put some washing in and then after dinner uh, i'm going to go to my favorite charity shop where they have the bric-a-brac but i'm also if i've got a chance nip to the garden center because i want to look at the christmas decorations not because i want to buy any such but i think it'd be really really nice to go and have a look and there's one near me that's really expensive and they have the most beautiful stuff so i thought i'll take you for a little trip around there and then we'll go to the charity shop if we hurry up and get all the other jobs done. So, without wasting any more time, let's get the washing in. Aww. Hello. Hello, baby. Oh, you look nice and clean and white, don't you? Hey, from yesterday, you're nice and clean. And good morning, Percy. Pinky. Bert. Look, it's not very nice out there. See what I mean? It's like gloomy and just, ugh. Hmm, and I've no idea why all three of my dogs have come in here to look at me. Look at them all. So I thought, we better give away this final calendar. Little Bubba. So little Bubba, he sadly died this year and he was, I don't think quite made it to ten. He was uh, so adorable. Um, and his lovely mum, little Bubba's mummy, made a calendar and he's raising money for Broken Biscuits, which is a charity that provides like wheelchair and stuff for little disabled dogs it's so cute and just so special and it changes the lives of little dogs so if you would like to win this bubba calendar uh what should we do i'm trying to think of a question or an emoji let me just have a quick think hang on right i've got an idea so if you want to win this calendar it doesn't matter where you are in the world all you need to do is tell me do you know a pug and what's its name so obviously we've got Winnie, um, there is Winnie's brother that we know, I think his name is Graham and I think Winnie's mum was called Honey um, but sadly she died. Um, I don't know whether I know any more pugs, can't think of any more, so we know a Graham. Oh and there is one that lives down the street. I can't remember what his name is though but there is one that lives near us as well and he's quite big and chunky um so do you know a pug and if you do what is their name oh so cute so good luck everybody we'll win pick a winner in a few days time breakfast Ooh, why have i got a dirty thumb i think it must be blueberry juice um so breakfast this morning brown flakes blueberries skimmed milk Right, here I am with my hair. <laughs> so obviously I've had my hair scraped back for the last few days. I've loved it. So I woke up tomorrow and I thought, Jane, don't scrape your hair back again. <laughs> Even though I really wanted to, I might do tomorrow. Uh, so I've just finished my third cup of tea in the morning and now we're on to jumper sorting. So I need to try trousers on as well. I seem to have a lot of trousers. So I need to do trousers, jumpers. 
have ended up with two grey jumpers that are very similar, Jane. You don't need two polar neck grey jumpers. Sparkles! Not sure how many sparkly jumpers I have and how many do I need. Do you ever just start something and think, oh, I don't want to do this? <laughs> I'm not sure about these. Um, they are brand new, I bought them and when I first bought them they were a bit tight, now they do fit me, but I don't know if I really like them. <laughs> I'm doing my own in now. So many of my trousers are a bit big and even some of my jumpers are a bit big, look. <laughs> I'm on to trousers. Oh, so jeans, ripped jeans. I feel like I've not worn ripped jeans for absolutely ages. My mum hates them. <laughs> I'm still clearing out, but now I'm being nosy. So two men have pulled up, isn't it, men? A man and a lady. A man and a lady, I wonder where they're going. Mm. So those people went to my neighbours, well, the people across the road. I think he cuts his holly for him, if I remember rightly. Uh, right, so I'm still sort of way through. It's about half to 11. I cannot believe I spent the whole morning doing this, but I've cleared a massive pile to get rid of. Right, I think I've done, well I've done up here, so I've put loads of stuff on Vinted, I've got loads of jeans, trousers, jumpers, all sorts of stuff. I've not done my cardigans yet, but I've done an awful lot up here, which is a job well done. Dinner! So for dinner today we've got Dairy Lee Dunkers, a uh, little tomato salad, a bit of cooked chicken, and some rabbit minis, not the minis, no, rabbit thins um, that I've all broken, so I've guessed that I've got about two cup of coffee in my Isle of Shopping Mug and of course all my friends are gathering around. Right and of course I've saved my friends a bit of chicken so you got a bit of chicken each. Right go. There's one of you. There's the other of you. And now we need to go and find little lazy Winifred who hasn't even come. Let's go find her. Winifred. She's sat there like what's all the fuss about? You've had yours. Right so Winifred. Hang on. No you've had yours. Move. No. No get my street voice on no this is winnie's no right eat it quick winnie quick i'm having to hold the fur people back <laughs> well, was that nice she didn't really swallow it much did you uh, chew it i mean look at dolly's ball it always looks like there's a blooming plum on the floor or something it's dolly's ball here's your ball you like your ball don't you <laughs> Was that nice, Winifred? Hey, it was nice. I enjoyed mine as well. It was lovely. <laughs> All the fluff attacking you. <laughs> right, we're ready. So, we're going to go to the garden centre and the chair shop if we've got time, because obviously we have to be back for bloody bus school run. Um, outfit there, I've got a parcel drop off, uh, red boots, jeans, blazer, scarf. A little fluffy bag, which is absolutely ridiculous and holds nothing, it's so small. Let's go. We've arrived. So let's go look at some pretty baubles. I'm not buying anything, she says. I just want to have a look. Let's go.
in the car I bought nothing I wasn't very inspired um normally when you go there it's absolutely beautiful but I don't it was much of a muchness I think there was more beautiful stuff probably in TK Maxx and obviously it's cheaper and like they had like no nutcrackers apart from just that little tiny handful of nutcrackers so I wasn't very impressed <laughs> probably a good job really but it was very very beautiful to look at and i enjoyed looking at it and the music is so soothing it makes you feel lovely um but the only nutcracker i want to get now is one from charity shop and i haven't found a second hand one so far so let's drive across to my favorite little charity shop oh actually so i thought while we're passing my little village that i like uh there's two charity shops here we've not been in for a while so we'll go and have a really quick look in them as well So how would a lettuce knife be any different to a normal yeah. knife? 
No, that's strange. Back in the car, school run, school run, school runs one again. So, I haven't got time to go to the other charity shop, but it was nice for a little rummage around here and talk to the little lady in the charity shop that I know and stuff. So, we are near a co op, so I'm just going to dash and get some fruit and then we'll go back and then we'll catch Ruby. Right, back in the car again. So, I've got all my bits and bobs, got a nice drink to have. I've heard these are real nice, so it's a Pepsi Max with mango let's go and get ruby oh right i'm sat waiting for her i can see her and she's stood talking come on ruby i want to go back home finally we're home yay hello hello have you missed us oh what have you got today what have you got oh you've got your egg oh that's lovely like your egg was it beautiful oh it's lovely <laughs> you never know what she's going to do with the toys. Aww. Quarter to four and it is this dark. Look how dark it is. It probably doesn't look that dark on camera, but it is. Are you okay, Winifred? Just think in the summertime, we'd normally be like going out to walk the dogs and stuff. And now it's getting dark. And what do we buy? I bought this. I really don't know if I like it or not. I like the tassels though. Look at the tassel on the back. Couldn't make my mind up, and I thought, oh, I'll get it. And if I decide I don't like it, I'll just put it on vintage. But what do you think? I thought with like a chunky jumper, obviously not with this scarf, but I thought with like a chum chumpy, chunky jumper. Um, if you had like a brownie coloured one, um, I think it might look really nice. But then also, I'm not sure. I couldn't make my mind up, so I thought, oh, it's one of the things. If I don't buy it, I wish I had. It's like floofy, like fake fur stuff. Um, 
Yeah, I'm not sure. Mm, the tea is in the oven. So tonight it's fish and chips and peas. Lovely. Ooh, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is my tea. So lovely bit of Young's fish, peas, low fat mayonnaise, uh, McCain lower fat chips with mozzarella melted on the top. Are you waiting to be fed? Hey, don't um, really. Are you yeah, waiting for me to get all? Oh. Like mm -hmm. It's feeding time. God, it's absolute chaos, right? Are you ready? We went away. No, right. I'm guessing. I'm guessing you're a bit hungry. Sound like a squeaky toy, right? Winnie for <laughs> husband. <laughs> Move out of my way. Coming through. We're coming through. Where are you? Woo! There you go. Enjoy. Oh, and I forgot to say, I also bought this as well today. So it's a berry, uh, but it's like a beautiful navy blue and you can tell it's wool it's got no tags inside but you can tell it is real wool it's really lovely uh well, i tried it in the shop i loved it i thought it actually matched my outfit as well what i've got on today right my dears we're back where we started this morning it's been a long day um so i'm going to love you and leave you don't forget if you want to win the little calendar let us know do you know any little pugs um, it doesn't matter if you don't, but if you do, just uh, drop us a little comment. And if you don't know any little pugs and you still want to enter, just give us a little dog emoji. Um, just let us know that you want to be in the draw to win it. Uh, I just thought it'd be fun to see what the pugs are called out there. So, many thanks for being there with me today. We hope you've enjoyed it. So, if you do enjoy just a little bit of real life, then please subscribe to my channel. Come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. My dogs have got Instagram, which is three fluffles. My website's down below. My little vintage down below. My A1's down below. It's all down below. So I love you and leave you. I'll see you tomorrow. I'm off to wash up. Ugh, fill the dishwasher up. And do pack up for everybody and all the other boring jobs that we have to do. So we'll see you bright and early tomorrow. See you tomorrow, Winnie Fred. See you tomorrow. Bye, everybody. <laughs> Say bye.